Hello, welcome back to my channel. Let me scoot up here. We have, hold on. I actually ordered this box from Ulta like a month ago and it's just been sitting here. So, I mean, I'm looking at it and I can remember some things, but otherwise I don't remember what I ordered. I also have a few other purchases and a little bit of PR. I'm gonna try to breeze through this so this isn't a super long video. Let's get to it. Um, I have the Way Detox Shampoo. This was like a gift of purchase, I think, or like there was a code, I can't remember. I really like this shampoo though. If you want your scalp to feel squeaky clean, this is the shampoo for you. And I really like the, the smell of the Way hair product. Oh uh, yeah, they smell good. I'm, I'm using one of these in my shower right now every now and then. I don't use it every day. There are new Tree Hut sugar scrubs. The Tree Hut sugar scrubs are my absolute favorite. And I, you know, I mean, it's just like a, like the weird flavored chips. I gotta try the weird flavored scrubs. I'm not gonna eat them, but I wanna try them. This is boba milk tea, black tea, coconut extract, and shea butter. Fun fact about me, I love milk tea. But those like snotty tapioca balls, I can't. I literally gagged when I tried to drink it. I can't do it. But I love milk tea. But every time, every time I get milk tea and they're like, "What boba's do you want?" I'm like, "No," and they just look at me like, "What?" I can't do it. I can't do it. It's like drinking snot. Oh, this is like a good fall smell. I can't. Does it smell like, I don't know what it smells like. It doesn't smell like coconut or black tea to me, but I love the tree hut scrubs. So this will definitely get used. I think there's another one here. Oh yeah. And then we have apple macchiato, apple extract, malic acid, and shea butter. I'm not a pumpkin spice girl. Okay. I'm just not. Oh, Ooh. Ooh, that smells good. Yeah. It smells apple-y, but yeah, like crisp apple-y. That smells really good. All right. I love Tree Hut. Um, I bought some new hair ties because, um, you know. So these are the Kitsch Recycled Nylon Hair Elastics. This color is called Eucalyptus. I don't like hair toned hair ties. I like a color. And then I bought the uh, hair elastics. Did I say hair ties? Hair elastics. I'm sorry. This is 20. This is 12. And these have little polka dots and it's neutral and green. And I thought these were adorable. I have this NYX eyeliner. Uh, Epic Wear Liner Stick in All Time Olive. I really like the NYX eyeliners. Not the Epic Smoke eyeliners. I do not like those at all. And I mean, I love an olive green. The Epic Wear, I don't think I've, have I tried this? They don't make the Slide On Glide On eyeliners anymore. Um, so I'm assuming this is a similar formula, but ooh, look at that color. Ooh. This is the Iconic London Luster Lip Oil in She's a Peach. I think it's worn off, but I was wearing the Jaclyn Hill Lip Oil today. Oh, wow. This is like very clear. I really like the packaging. Does it smell like peach? Oh, it does. Oh, it smells like peach jam. Mm, that smells really good. Uh, I've never tried it. I know nothing about it. Do they suck? Feels nice. I don't know, but I bought it. Why am I putting it back in the box? Again, I don't um, know. I love this perfume. I had a mini and I loved it so much. I want the full size, but that's a lot. So we're gonna, maybe we'll wait for like a 20% off points redemption to buy the full size bottle. But I bought the uh, travel sprayer of the Ellis Brooklyn Sun Fruit. Why don't perfume bottles put the notes on the package? <sighs> this smells so good. It's so fruity. But we're going to my coffee. Oh my gosh. I don't know. I'll put the notes on the screen. It smells fantastic. I love this. Oh my gosh, if that had broken, I would have, I wouldn't have cried. I would have been furious. I think this was on sale. This is the REM Beauty or REM Beauty. I say REM because the letters are separated, but I feel like most people call it REM Beauty. Uh, Midnight Shadows Eyeshadow Palette Groovy Baby. I don't know why I bought this because I don't mean this to be mean, but I hate the packaging. It looks like gift with purchase packaging. And that's so mean. 
you know, I just wanted to try the eyeshadows because I haven't bought new eyeshadow palette in a while. I mean, up until this video. And these are colors that I will wear. The packaging feels sturdy, like it doesn't feel cheap. I just don't like the look of it. And I'm a big fan of the Bare Minerals blushes and bronzers, and they have new colors. This one is called Kiss of Spice and it looks like metallic rose gold oh my gosh but it also looks so pretty i don't know um the rest of the alta stuff is all like gift with purchase and there's two bags we're gonna go through this very quickly okay. we have the mario badescu clarifying serum with azalea acid. We have the Redken Acidic Bonding Concentrate Shampoo and Conditioner. We have the CeraVe Hyd- oh gosh, ow. <laughs> I like hit my ankle bone. Hydrating Facial Cleanser for Normal to Dry Skin. Let's see if my husband wants that. Oh, Better Not Younger Super Power Purifying Hair and Scalp Serum. Oh, that sounds interesting. I do love a scalp serum. The Belief this is hilarious. I can't even tell you how many samples I've gotten of this and I've still never tried this belief. True Cream Aqua Bomb. I'm going to try it, okay? I promise. <laughs> the Peach and Lily Glass Skin Refining Serum. Clinique All About Eyes. Reduces circles, puffs. Mega Babe Space Bar Detox Fine Charcoal Underarm Bar. Oh, that's interesting. I've never tried anything from Mega Babe. I feel like Heather likes that brand or I know she's tried a bunch of the brand. This is the Philosophy Dose of Wisdom Bouncy Skin Reactivating Serum. I mean, I, honestly, all this stuff sounds kind of interesting. The Anastasia Brow Definer Triangle Brow Pencil in Medium Brown. Um, I don't use brow products usually, so I don't know about that. Polo Ralph Lauren Red Parfum. Peace Out Acne for Healing Dots. I actually, I'm going to keep these and use these for like bug bites. I mean, I'll use them for acne too if I need to, but... I mainly want to keep them for bug bites. They work really well for that. And then Buxom Full On Plumping Lip Polish in Dolly. I have, I think, a full size of this. So Perfect Repair Treatment Mask for Hair. Oh, wait. No, Nature Lab Perfect Repair. That, like, brand that has their bottles look like beakers. The Estee Lauder Nutritious Melting Soft Cream Mask. Is this for hair? Is this for face? What do you use this for? Normal Combo oily okay it's a melting soft i'm kind of curious about this melting it just says melting soft cream mask the nars light reflecting setting powder pressed angel elixir mugler parfum i'm not a big fan of angel i don't really like olaplex hair number three <laughs> number three hair perfector Dermalogica Special Cleansing Gel. The Strivectin Anti-Wrinkle Peptide Plump Line Filling Bounce Serum. Vichy Life Active Supreme HA Serum. 1.5% Pure Hyaluronic Acid Visible Filling Effect. We have the Sun Balm Hair Mask, Deep Conditioning Hair Mask Enriched with Coconut Oil, Sunflower Seed Extract, and Banana Fruit Extract. I didn't know Sun Balm did hair stuff out of it. Aren't they sunscreen? The Clean It Zero Cleansing Balm. Look at how tiny and cute this is. I gotta see what this looks like. Oh my gosh, it's like a little pod. It's so cute. That's adorable. I have actually had this brand in my list to try for makeup remover for a long time and I just keep getting other ones to use instead. So I'm, I'm excited to try that in my loves list on Elta. Did I say that? I don't think I, I don't think I completed a sentence. <laughs> Uh, Sunday Riley Good Jeans. I have several of those. And then La Roche Posay 60. Whoa. Melt in Milk Sunscreen. Ooh. Milk Sunscreen. I don't know about that. Good Molecules Hyaluronic Acid Serum. This is like a full size. I might have this. I'm not sure. Um, I don't know what's going on with my life. I think that I'm. I don't know. Having dementia. So I had another Ulta order from like weeks prior and I had another sun fruit, <laughs> which is fine because I really do love this perfume. And I think one was on sale and then one was like, you earned like a bajillion points or something. I don't know. Um, I bought one of the Jaclyn Cosmetics pressed blushes 
And then the next day they went on sale for like 25% off and I had ordered it online. So I just ordered it again and then returned the initial one. I got the color uh, Tangerine Pop. This is really pretty. I love an orange blush, you know? Gives you kind of like a sunburned look. I'm, I really like this. Uh, the formula seems really nice. It's pigmented, but not like crazy. What have I done to my face pigmented? Um, this summer we did the Cara Color Color and Conditioner color in Avery's hair. We did the purple one and it looked super cute. We wanted it for the summer. These were on sale and I thought, you know what? I kind of want to try that for my hair. So we have a purple one and I've also bought the emerald one. So if I have green hair one day, it is this. This is normally $22. We didn't use a lot of it and we used it several times. So this will definitely last a long time, but it was half off when I bought it or it was like $13, almost half off. We're gonna have colored hair, you know? This was, I'm not sure where, I, I don't know what happened with this. I think this was a, I don't really know what happened. This is the Kapari Golden Aura Body Oil with 24 karat gold and hyaluronic acid. I'm not really sure what came over me to like buy a body oil, but it's really pretty. I haven't used it yet, clearly. Look how little makeup there is here. And there's like skincare and hair care. Am I maturing? Gross. There are a bunch of other gifts with purchase here. We're gonna talk about those. La Roche-Posay Dermatologist Recommended Skincare Routine. This has got the cleanser, serum, moisturizer, and a sunscreen. I, I don't know what I'm gonna keep, what I'm not gonna keep. There's the number seven Future Renew Damage Reversal Serum. There's a NYX gift with purchase. There's a NARS gift with purchase. There's a Kopari gift with purchase. I don't know. This is the Afterglow Lip Balm in their favorite shade, Orgasm. The Afterglow Liquid Blush in their favorite shade. And I'm just gonna assume that this is also Orgasm. Oh, this is Orgasm X. Their packaging is really pretty. I gotta be honest, I don't love this shade. Um, it's very shimmery. Like, I'm just really not into it. I know I bought like a all shimmer blush earlier, but a pinky shimmer blush, I just don't think this looks good on me. So I'm not gonna keep that one for Next gift with purchase. Don't know why this was in here, but it was fine. This is Juice Gloss Watermelon Sugar. I don't know if I have this color. I have a couple of these and I do like them. So if I don't have this color, I'm for sure gonna keep it. Uh, the NYX Epic Wear Liner Stick in Pink Spirit. A pink eyeliner. Love it. Plump Right Back Plumping Serum. I have a full size of this, so I'll pass this on. And then the Dewy Finish <laughs> Makeup Setting Spray. I do not need help with that, so I'll probably just keep that for foily and eyeshadow. <laughs> I don't need to be dewier. Okay. And then we have a Kopari gift to purchase. And Kopari is a brand, oh gosh, that I want to try more from. But I kind of just don't know where to begin. So this is cool. So we have the Sun Shield Soft Glow Daily Face SPF, the Lip Glossy Clear, the Kopari Ultra Restore Body Butter, and then this is the Niacinamide and Caffeine Eye Bright Cream. Okay, so very quickly, I purchased a few things from Dashing Diva because I love the Dashing Diva nail strips. I just wanted to. So I bought, these are called Pristine Pearl. Cute little pink, pink guys. We had um, Snowball Fight, which I don't want, but they're cute for winter. And then I bought these for Avery. These are the Dashing Diva Magic Pick Kids. And these are called Creepy Crawlers and they glow in the dark. Halloween. I am actually an affiliate with Dashing Diva now, so I do um, have like an affiliate link. If you use the link, I earn a small commission. Thank you so much. Um, but I bought these from the Dashing Diva website. The Dashing Diva website, you get free shipping at $15, which I mean, you can buy like two things of nail, nail strips and they ship everything really quickly. I really like shopping at their website. And you can earn rewards on their um, website for discounts and things like that. So I'll have that link listed in the description box. And if you use it and I earn, I earn a small commission, thank you so much. I bought a few things from TJ Maxx a couple weeks ago because I wanted to. So this is the Revolution Pro Night and Day Color Focus Shadow Palette. And I don't buy a lot from Makeup Revolution, but this looks really pretty. I like the packaging. It's like slightly textured. 
And then I also don't wear a lot of baked eyeshadows, but this just looks so pretty. And there's a plastic sheet on here with the names, which I'll just stick right here. But can you see this? This looks purple to me, but green. Oh, it's this just looked really beautiful. And I am really excited to try this color. It's called Steel. I also found this and I have I had owned the NYX Ultimate, the big version, like I can't remember what they're called, in Utopia and um, it, it's just too big. It's like a 36 shade palette. It's, it's very large. I just don't use palettes that large anymore. But I loved the colors in it and so I saw this Ultimate shadow palette in called Ultimate Utopia and I thought yes this this is something I would get behind this green of course is my favorite is what drew me in I haven't used this yet but um the other NYX shadows that I have used from like the Ultimate shadow line are very nice this I think was like five dollars at TJ Maxx and then they also had this and I wasn't gonna get this when it initially launched and I thought you know it's really cute so this is the Glamly and Barbie palette the Dream Summer palette I can't, did this come out this year or did it come out last year? I've never seen any movie in the world have as much promotion as the Barbie movie ever. Collabs with everything. But I can't, I think this came out last year, right? But it's so colorful and pretty and I really like the Glam Light formula. I did get a few things from Smashbox in PR. They send stuff every now and then, which is fine. But they sent some of the Halo products. This is the Smashbox Halo Healthy Glow All-in-One Tinted, Tinted Moisturizer. They sent the shade light neutral i have not used this today i'm used this yet i meant to use it today and i forgot and then they sent two shades of the halo healthy glow four in one perfecting pen this is the shade t10n and then um l10n which looks more like my shade so i'm going to give this to one of my friends because i will not get use out of this but um i'm excited to try these i haven't tried a new concealer in a very long time because I just haven't been wearing a lot of concealer, but I, I, I'm excited to try these. So thank you, Smashbox. Lastly, I have a box of nail polish from Salon Perfect. They've been so kind to send me um, like a curated box of stuff each month for the past few months. And it's always like a mixture of things. So this is like a really fall inspired box, which is awesome. Um, let's see here, new season, who dis? We're in our fall feelings. You know, the ones, crunchy leaves, hot drinks, endless supply of comfy socks. Just kidding. Uh, after a good summer fling, blah, blah, blah. Be the pick of the patch with our nail sets, lacquer, and lashes that will have you looking gourd and feeling fine for under $6.94. Slim Perfect is so affordably priced. I love it. That's one of the reasons I love their nail polish, but their nail polish is also so good. Um, available exclusively at Walmart stores nationwide and walmart.com. So let's see what's in here. Hold on. I'm going to spill my coffee everywhere. I don't want to break my busty mug. We've got some lashes. I don't really wear lashes, so I'm going to pass these on. But we have the soft and smoky diffused tips. We have the... Wait, are these named? Oh, they're just numbered. So there's 647 and 648. We have a little black lash with built-in liner, number 640 and 642. We have the wispies. We have nails. So this is, ooh, those are cute. What are these called? Do they have names? What am I, am I losing my mind? Modern art. Look at those. Those are cute. I don't think you can see because of the glare. Oh, those are cute. Modern Nostalgia. Cute. Glazed Chrome Powder Effect. Oh. This is really hard to see because I want to show you the glare is modern art. Little shorty guys. And then Liquid Gold. Oh, those are cute too. All right, so I'm gonna keep a couple of these and I do want to try them at some point, but you know, whenever I don't have things to swatch, which will be. But um, I did give my niece some of those a couple months ago and she was like really excited to get them. So I will definitely pass on what I 
I'm not gonna use two very excited people. We also have, oh, there's more. We have some One Step gel pens, and I'm very excited to try these because I didn't love the flash reflective gel pen, but I, because that's so textured, I, I don't think that's like an easy way to use um, like a pen at nail polish application. So I'm very curious to try a solid color or a, a cream. This is Way Back When and Pillow Talk. I love this. I mean, obviously it's blue. If it's a blue, just assume I love it, you know? We have, oh, there's another of the gel lamps. I do have one of these. L Acrylic, L Acrylic, L Acrylic. Long wear base coat. And then there are eight nail polishes. Let me open these up. This is the keratin treatment called birth, uh, keratin treatment line called birthmark beauty like a mocha cream the acrylic strength line called laid back lavender that's beautiful a top coat and then the pillow talk bottle version of the pen uh this is more from the acrylic strength line this is called take it easy terracotta and keen green and then the last two are uh, this is called way back when so again the bottled version of the pen. And then this is called Relaxed Rose from the Acrylic String Plant. So very fall colors. Thank you so much, Salon Perfect. I mean, I think that's everything. So I would love to know what you guys have purchased lately. Please let me know if you have tried any of these things. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't already and give this video a thumbs up and I'll talk to you in my next video.